gentamicin, also known by the trade name sitomycin. Gentamicin is indicated for the treatment of gram-negative infections and may be used as a synergistic agent in gram-positive infections, particularly gram-positive endocarditis. Gentamicin works by inhibiting bacterial protein synthesis. The therapeutic classification of gentamicin is an anti-infective agent, and the pharmacologic class is an aminoglycoside. Special considerations for nursing include that gentamicin may cause a tinnitus-like hearing loss, and therefore it should not be administered alongside other autotoxic drugs, such as vancomycin and penicillins, unless clinically necessary. Gentamicin use should be cautioned against in those with renal impairment. Status of the patient's infection should be monitored frequently, and if cultures are required as part of the anti-infective treatment regimen, they should be acquired prior to starting gentamicin therapy. Liver and renal function tests should be monitored while on gentamicin, as should the blood levels of the drug, as target trough ranges are important to verify the safety of the use of gentamicin. In patients that are at high risk for hearing loss that you may not normally want to use gentamicin in, but gentamicin may be clinically necessary based on cultures and sensitivity reports, there is some evidence to show that one gram TID of acetylsalicylic acid, or aspirin, may reduce the rate of hearing loss and is a therapy that should be considered in these patients. Visit nrsng.com slash 50 meds for our free cheat sheet covering the 50 meds every nurse must know. That's nrsng.com slash 50 meds. This has been another MedMaster podcast by nrsng.com with your host, licensed pharmacist Cody Magnuson, BSC, PharmD candidate. Now, from all of us at NRSNG, thanks for being here and happy nursing.